I'm still running the new with with the light going at Am Green. Launching it, I I set my launch to six thousand. That's where my launch stays until mm -hmm. I drop the clutch. Lower or higher? Much higher. You can't say much higher, it all depends on the track. Yes. It depends on the track, your weight, the power of the bike. Okay, so firstly, let me stop you. Do you use launch control? Yes, I do. Don't. As a drag racer, that is just restricting you as a rider. It's killing power of your bike because it's taking away power, trying to avoid wheelies. You need to learn your throttle with your clutch. It's going to be working hand in hand. Your launch control does not work. In South Africa, our tracks do not accommodate for it. The, the aftermarket ECUs, uh, as Bazaar's Rapid Bike, uh, Power Commander launch control does not work as good as the Haltex and stuff like that. So get to know your bike, use your clutch and your throttle because every track is different. If there's traction, you can give more RPM. If there's no traction, you have to launch at a lower RPM. You might have to throw out your clutch. You might have to feed your clutch. You might have to ride your clutch a bit. So it's all a riding style. You have to ride your bike according to what the track is going to take. The time you're going to get, you're going to lose so much time on launch control. It's a lot. Like it's, it's a hell of a lot. Um, it kills all the power on the bike. Like you, you have to set it just you and motor. And you just have to practice until we figure it out just you and motor because even on the lowest lowest setting even on whichever bike it's it's gonna the minute that wheel spins and it has to cut power to keep your traction you've really lost you've really lost it so while i'm going my rear tire is spinning half the time while it's lifting and you're tapping the back brake to keep the nose down a little bit so you're keeping it in power band and then sometimes it just lifts too high and you have to you have to tap off um and get back into it but if the minute you tap off if you tap off a little bit on a quarter mile you're not gonna break good times so just one little release just to let the bike go down a little bit you're gonna drop a drop almost yeah it's, it's a lot yeah so oh launch control 3.8 seconds not 200 draggy time with the launch control um i do 2.7 well my best is 2.7 but i average 2.8 2.9 on a normal road, no prep, not 200. So that's how much slower launch control is compared to launching it yourself. I have to add something here. I have to be honest with everybody that my bike is not 100% stock. I removed my plastic number plate holder. <laughs> okay. That was so I no longer have a plastic number plate holder at the back. So my bike is no longer stock. <laughs> 